What's up everybody? Welcome to another episode of the PSG Esports Bite. I'm the Esports Evangelist, Brian Barasa. Now, this episode is sponsored by Pepino's Pizza. So get down to Pepino's branches on Kimathi Street and Total Ruaka and grab yourself two double pizzas for only 1,200 Kenyan shillings. American rapper Austin Richard Post, popularly known as Post Malone, has acquired an undisclosed stake in Envy Gaming. The esports organization is parent to Dallas Empire, Dallas Fuel and esports outfit Team Envy. How can I see how many people are watching? The Dallas, Texas born rapper is an avid gamer himself who has his own Twitch channel and also doubles as a brand ambassador for gaming peripherals company HyperX. Couple mil. Nice creepy. Speaking of esports superstars, one name that may not come as a surprise is LA Lakers' very own LeBron James. Only this time we aren't talking about the father but the son. LeBron James Jr., or Brony as he's known, has signed with esports organization FaZe Clan. Streaming as FaZe Brony, he will bring with him over 300,000 followers on Twitch and 4.3 million followers on TikTok. And finally, the FIFA Fan Fest Season 2 Pool 2 came to a close with the final round gamers going at it for the last 8 slots. The top 3 slots went to Mom Mawano in 1st place, Abandoned Fuel 167 in 2nd place, and Namzi in 3rd place. Now, Mom Mawano joins us to talk about how that experience was. So, Mawano, welcome to the bench again. Uh, it's a pleasure uh, being here. So today I have a couple of questions, but these are not from me. They are some from, from some of the fans and they want to know. So the first question I'll ask is, um, you've had a chance to be on the GOAT seat uh, for a couple of seasons right now. Do you believe that there's a shelf life to being a pro gamer? Well, uh, I believe, yes. Uh, when I started, uh, absolutely not, uh, around 2013. But right now, in, in 2020, they suddenly hope uh, with, the, with the number of organizations that are coming in to, to partner with PSG and uh, you know to just make uh, esports better. Uh, we have uh, PSG uh, with the FIFA Fan Fest, uh, you know, being that eFootball is the biggest esport in Kenya, uh, it, it can certainly make a career out of it. Because uh, other than PSG with the FIFA Fan Fest, we have uh, uh, the Mtani League coming up with Decoded, where they are giving away 100,000 shillings each month. So, in terms of earning and making a career out of it with growth, I think there is certainly certainly growth since I, since I came into the industry. All right. And the, question, the second question uh, one of our fans asked is that uh, Mawano is becoming a big name uh, in Kenya right now, in, in the FIFA scene uh, more specifically. What are you going to do to help those guys who are coming up and would like to join esports as a career? Well, I'll tell them that they should organize, you know, and uh, try to join esports fraternities, esports teams, just like the Masters of Mayhem, where they can be taught to how to increase their level of the game. And uh, when you're young, one thing you're supposed to be looking at is growth rather than earning. So in terms of growth, I'll tell them to join Twitch, join YouTube, you know, start streaming and uh, start accumulating a following. And uh, trust me that uh, once the followers and the subscribers come up, they will certainly have uh, a, a bright future in the business. All right. Someone else wants to find out what other games do you play intensely and how long do you take on training on those games? Uh, well, uh, the other game that I've been playing quite intensely is the Apex Legends. I, uh, I want to become a, a predator in, uh, in the Battle Royale game, but uh, I play it maybe two, two hours a day, you know, just uh, to learn the basics and uh, just keep up with uh, the, the best out there. All right. Quite interesting question someone here asks. When you're playing competitively, do you stand or do you sit? I sit. Um, I, like be, I like sitting and being really close to the screen so I can see everything. Yeah, I have to sit. All right. One final question. Um, which professional gamer across the world would you like to play and uh, for what reason? Well, uh, in my opinion, it has to be Fnatic Tex. You know, he hasn't won uh, a World Cup yet, but in my opinion, if I every time I watch him play, he teaches me something new. And if I could play with the Tex on a regular basis, I think that will increase my game tremendously. All right. 
Thank you so much, Mawano, for coming through to the Esports Bite. As always, we wish you all the best as you get into the Champions E Cup. It's a pleasure being here and see you at the Champions E Cup. Oh, great. The FIFA Fan Fest now proceeds to the Champions League Cup, so keep it here for more information on who will be crowned the Ultimate Season 2 King of FIFA. Now look out for more updates on our social media platforms, Pro Series Gaming on Facebook, at Pro Series Gaming on Instagram, at Pro Series Game on Twitter, and Pro Series Gaming on Discord. You can also log on to our website, that's www.psg.co.ke, to see what we've been up to. Also, subscribe to the Just Games podcast, that's on www.soundcloud.com slash justgamespodcasts and leave us a comment or a review. Now that's all the time we've had for today. It's always a pleasure hearing from you. So keep liking, subscribing and leaving your comments. I've been your host, the esports evangelist, Brian Barasa, keeping it esports. Mm -hmm.